anything specific to improve relationship with spouse on parenting okay spouse and parents you know you have to first think about how to where is the area where, where you feel there is lot of gap why if you feel there is lot of gap which core value you guys are not able to match up with each other okay because the reason why we have conflict as i have explained in my previous sessions the conflict of interest between two parties is always when the core values are not matching like right? for me suppose i am looking at independency as one of my core values so i would expect all my family members also to be independent or think independently uh, live independently okay this will be my basic uh, expectation and imagination okay second is if i am having a core value where i want i i see happiness is my you know core thing without happiness like if pizza makes me happy yes i'm good uh, if a movie makes me happy yes i'm doing well but if something doesn't makes me happy and it keeps on happening again and again or someone doesn't make me happy so what will happen there will be lot of gap thought process wise we are not going to match with the other person so what is that core value gap you need to identify and then according to that you have to make sure that you are um you know trying to fill it up understanding that no fingers are like all fingers are not same people won't be same okay you just have to find a midpoint where you both can have an arrangement for kids and uh, you know i always say as a coach and as a parent as a wife that no matter how many levels of differences you have but when it comes to kids both the parents should be on the same page for the betterment of child should be on the same page so you need to talk it out with your spouse keeping kids away like you know don't talk in front of your child go somewhere out of the house and then put your points properly and take it in writing so all in all what happens when we talk we have lot and lot and lot of uh, expectations and we feel ki bahut problem hai but when it, when it comes to writing you know we write very less and that's the reality of uh, uh, gap area problem itna hi hai but in our head while speaking and thinking we make it this much okay like how we feel that oh in exam i can write a lot because i have memorized a lot but the moment when it comes to writing the exam we are getting very few points to write about right so same way whenever you have an argument please make sure that both of you are sitting together and uh, writing each other's disappointment expectations plus points negative points you know so this way you will come to know ki acha itne ka maine itna bawal soch ke rakha tha at least that level of filtration is necessary for both of you okay so i hope this helps to the person whom i am who asked this question yes writing is very important they will always back off okay like men men don't like writing <laughs> women would love to journal and all in general and say i'm just giving a general opinion here so do it but this exercise is a very good exercise very powerful exercise okay right see that is uh, one so i'm getting one comment here again and again that my husband doesn't write in the journal and i think i expect very least things from him to change stop expecting the person to change don't do that that's a mistake you are making you are hurting yourself the person sh- it should come from within that i need to improve i need to change okay otherwise it will uh, only be a tug of war you are trying to pull him this side in your team and the husband is trying to pull you in this side in his team okay so don't get into that tug of war first of all respect your identity and uh, be comfortable with the fact that you and your husband are not same and it's okay it's okay i'm sure he is a good person good human that is more important okay so don't get into that tug of war i am not a perfect wife for my husband my husband is not a perfect husband for me but then i'll never find another man who can tolerate me so well <laughs> or whom i can tolerate so well so 
is is about how much we uh, you know is that is what love is about commitment like i'm i'm here for lifetime he is here with me for lifetime no matter what so focus on that rather than you know thinking oh why is he like that why can't he change things will be so much better i'm telling you i meet so many celebrities i coach them sab ki lagi padi hai nobody's life is perfect trust me when i say this kitna bhi paisa hone do okay kitna bhi power hone do andar se sab khokla hai so if you have a well grounded relationship bless yourself and feel lucky so just work on yourself exactly what nilima is suggesting work on yourself and your husband will tag along because i'll tell you um everybody wants a proof everybody so if i am saying uh, that waking up early is good okay so each of you would like to see if i am doing well or not correct so if i give you a proof that yes i am doing well for myself by waking up early then you will believe me and you will also start waking up early same example you have to put it in your marriage context so do not talk about your self development show your self development i always say that show and tell show and tell okay mm-hmm.